was in December 2010. Around this train station, the Tunisian Revolution claimed its first two victims. And many here in Bouzayen don't agree that the revolution has ended. Safwan was and remains one of the leaders of the revolutionaries. Derrière la station de police d'ici, où les policiers ont ont fait le tir de balle d'ici, et les martyrs sont tués ici. Drab aoul wahed liou shawqi hidri, drab le cartouche. Jam Mohamed Amari bi ijbed fi, direct tam qansu bi rassasin rassasa. Safwan explains that Bouzayan's youth often use graffiti and drawings to protest. Safwan then takes us to what used to be the government's local delegation. The villagers burned it down in 2013 following the murder of a left-wing politician from the region. The government left the building as it is, Safwan says. The delegate stops by once a week. This room used to be the delegate's office. <laughs> Safwan stands accused of leading the attack. He says he wasn't even there. He would have liked to, he adds. Now Bouzayan's youth squats the building from time to time. They come here to drink and laugh. Four years after the revolution, Safwan and his friends are hoping for jobs. They want to see the region grow. Safwan says he will continue the fight until his revolution has really ended.